Hey everybody, what's going on? Snowy Mantar here. Welcome back to another video on the channel. Hope you all have yourselves a wonderful day today. Uh, this video, I wanted to discuss locker bundles with you all because there's been a lot of talk about locker bundles pretty much throughout the past few years, ever since they were essentially a thing in Fortnite. And I wanted to talk about them here today, more or less about the surprise of locker bundles. So for those who don't know what locker bundles are in Fortnite, essentially they are a bunch of very random cosmetics that are put into this one bundle for a whole discounted price. And it's usually tied to a content creator picking out the certain cosmetics, or in some cases it's usually maybe a celebrity or a musician, or I believe at some point, I think we've had a few sports players get locker bundles, which is pretty cool. But it's more or less meant for content creators, which is a cool thing. And this is kind of the reason why this video is being made because as the this video going up it's gonna be going up on Saturday I'm actually recording this on a Friday we are actually going to be getting a brand new locker bundle this Sunday and it is I talk I cannot believe that he's finally getting a locker bundle I have it on screen showing it off to you all here it's really damn good not only because I've been wanting pick it up to return for a very long time but it's gonna be very discounted for me because I own pick it up and I own power cord from this bundle so yeah it's gonna be really cheap for me and also it's kind of an excuse for me to put this in the thumbnail a little bit but not really but yeah very well deserved long overdue as well and people actually were really confused about these locker models because here's the thing there this wasn't the only locker model that got leaked out there was two others we actually have the Zephyr's locker bundle as this video recording it is in the shop right now um but the other one I might, i'm gonna talk about a little bit later i don't know how to really go about this i guess the best way to go about this here is this fortnite should honestly make locker bundles a surprise kind of similar to how they do with icon skins in a way which I'll talk about a little bit later in the video, but I do have a few points on why I do believe Epic should actually go about this and actually say, hey, maybe we should redo the locker bundles to make them so that they are a surprise. And the first point of this video is that they get leaked too early. Going back to the iTalk Fortnite one, for example, obviously it got leaked out the day of when the update went live and it kind of ruined the surprise on who the locker bundle actually goes, to, goes for, you know what I mean? And also not only that, the bundles tied to item shop api as well and it shows italk's name in the freaking files which is tied to that specific bundle which is a really big shame i'm not the biggest fan of when they get leaked out like this but here's the thing i'm not angry at the leakers i'm not angry at them at all i would not suggest anyone to go and harass them due to that fact because this is epic that we're talking about here these are the, those are the ones who are initially behind this whole thing because i do firmly believe that they should actually actually encrypt the names of the item shop APIs. We actually kind of saw this with the Zephyr's locker bundle. Again, I'm just gonna say this here. Sorry if I'm saying that name completely wrong. Um, They actually renamed it to Kabang, believe it or not. That was actually the code name for it before it got actually, actually got the name in for this recent update. I do believe that they should do some form of a code name for these locker bundles other than putting in the actual names of the content creators that are getting a locker bundle. This actually goes on to my second point on why I do believe that these should be a surprise and that actually has to do with content creators get, well, don't take this in that different aspect here, harassed. I know that sounds really weird putting it like that. Now, I'm not saying like, oh, they're getting harassed by the Party Royale players or the flexors who are mad about pick it up returning to the shop because I'm seeing a lot of people getting mad over that or even like special forces coming back in the, I'm gonna spoil it right now, Tabor Hill's locker bundle. It is confirmed that that is his locker bundle. I might as well show it on screen here because his locker bundle. I mean, just look at it. It's insane. I mean, holy crap. But yeah, people got mad over that regard because they want OG edit style for the special forces skin. That's not happening, people. People, sorry, just gonna tell you straight up. You don't deserve a locker bundle if you're still getting mad over item shop cosmetics in 2023 You're a douche canoe, but anyways with that out of the way I didn't want it to turn into a little rant there. Um, the way I'm saying that it's harassment It's more or less. Hey, when is it coming out? Do you know when this cosmetics are coming out? Congratulations on getting the locker bundle I know that the content creators who get the locker bundles want to say thank you They want to say something but unfortunately they can't say anything and it's due to the fact that they they're under a contract, ladies and gentlemen. That's probably like the biggest reason and most likely the biggest like actual realistic approach to where I'm coming from here is that they're most likely under a contract from Epic to where they can't disclose any information about the locker bundles. So let's say if I was to get a locker bundle, which I don't think that will ever happen in the future, but you never know. I, I don't even think that will ever happen. But here's the thing. If I was to ever get a locker bundle, if I was getting berated on Twitter with a whole bunch of messages 
is and also on youtube saying congratulations on the locker bundle you got a locker bundle oh my god this is so long overdue i can't say a word about it like i legit can't even say thank you at all like whatsoever literally cannot disclose it with anyone until it is the appropriate time for me to talk about it kind of like with italk for example no no pun intended it took him over a week to finally start talking about his locker bundle and that's that's a really big shame because he knew that it was leaked out he even said it in his video believe it or not which is just sad even Tabor hill knows about the locker bundle being a thing which he did address on the day of when the update went live because he got berated with a bunch of comments and things like that going like oh my god he got a locker bundle but he can't talk about it until it gets fully revealed until he actually gets that chance to reveal it which is honestly really sad and this leads me on to my third point which is going to be continuing about this at all and that is the content creators can't even speak about this until it's the appropriate time it's a really big damn shame because this is a huge accomplishment and yet it's being spread around the internet everywhere and it's a really big shame because epic doesn't want to keep this as a huge surprise because again they add these to the files pretty much almost every update at this point we've been getting at least one locker bundle leak and it's a really big shame because like i know for a fact a lot of people are excited for locker bundles when they get leaked out because they want to see some really unique cosmetics in them like just recently as i got a mention with zepfar's locker bundle that he brought back the uh the gumdrop glider which was a really rare glider which i actually owned and i did buy this bundle because this was i only missed like one cosmetic out of here and it was heavily discounted but here's the thing i don't even think he was allowed to talk about this because this bundle was in the leaks for a really long time when i mean a really long time i believe it was in the files for at least a month which is just crazy heck it even got so bad that some content creators actually had to ban certain words like locker bundles and leaks in their chats i remember one content creator sparkles qt she actually got a locker bundle which i might as well show on screen for people who don't know what this locker bundle is she actually had to ban and block the terms locker bundles entirely from her twitch chat because she wasn't even allowed to talk about it do you see the point here people i do honestly feel like epic should take the approach to how they do icon skins honestly and that is to have the content creators announce it before it gets added to the files because this would make it a huge surprise going like hey i'm getting a locker bundle these are my cosmetics it's going to be coming out on this date it's not in the files as of right now but it will be in the files on this update and then it'll be available in the item shop probably during that week whenever it does get announced other than it being added to the files and then content creators getting harassed by people and not literally harassed but getting bombarded with comments everywhere and not even being allowed to even say thank you you or congratulations it's an it's a really big shame i really hope epic does change the way they do bundles in here because again i love locker bundles i think they are some of the best things that come out of the item shop and one of the best ideas that epic has done in a long time but it's just a really big shame on how they're actually going about this because it seems like they don't really care that much which is really sad but that is it for today's video i hope you all enjoyed this video if you did happen to enjoy this video consider subscribing to the channel turn notification bell so you don't any more new videos from me to do below weekly drop a like on the video if you did happen to enjoy this video i also have a twitter that is at snowman on twitter if you want to go follow me thank you all so much for watching i love every single one of you remember everyone it's always good to take chances